What's up, yo? It's your boy Nimius, and I got another video for you, Call of Duty. And this first part, I'm gonna open up a couple supply drops to see what I get. And it's usually nothing ever good. I hardly ever get elites. And I thought that I thought that elites was funny quarterback because when I play football, you know, IRL obviously not, that's my position as quarterback. But I finally get an elite, and it's Garbage. Look at that. Minus one to accuracy, minus one to range, and like one or two to handling. It's stupid. But here we go. I finally get back into this game. I'm using the same class as the last video, which I probably should have put it out, but it's just the Battle 27 Obsidian Steed with UAV uh, care package and AI controlled Warbird, which. Kinda okay to use in this map, but at the same time, it's it's kind of difficult because you know there's so many buildings and so many people like to hide in buildings and everybody camps, especially in the middle of domination B. Like I don't know, people. There's even I've even played clans and teams where they will. It's not very strategic, but at the same time, it's. They'll just sit inside the middle building and just camp each side. Like, at least four of them will. Like, if it's a six man team, four of them will do that, and then two will guard A or C, you know, whichever side they spawn on. And it can get quite annoying, but you just gotta learn how to remain But, you know, in this game, I, I guess, part of this game specifically, but in general, you know, as much as I've preached on it, like, I get killed my back so much, and it's just so frustrating. Uh, but I've had some good, uh, good timing in this game, which that's probably what I've been lacking of these last couple days. So, I don't know how I don't kill all of my. I guess that was terrible aim, and I don't know how I got that guy right there either. Like, how was that guy's aim, you know, or reaction so fast that when I, maybe it's maybe it's like a server lag or like I don't know, refresh rate lag or something where on his screen I didn't boost as fast as I did on mine. But it just it amazes me how some people's aim is so good where they can you know immediately follow you and you boost. I thought that part was funny too, where I just got a random headshot on some guy I didn't even see. But when you boost, how like their aim automatically follows you, like how can you be that good? I don't know. It's it's crazy. Some people are just godlike. I just love spawning and throwing random maze because you. Nobody plays the objective like domination correctly to where you know your team stays on one side with the A or C and you have one of the out the perimeter ones and then you have B and you know like back in Call of Duty 4 I used to be in a clan where we would sit on one side of the map, never cross a um, certain line. Which I, I usually just say the point of B, but you would never cross B, and you would just pretty much hold down that side of the map, and everybody would get a different, I guess, lane, as you could put it, to where you're pretty much defending one small area, and that way the enemy never crosses. But in this game, and Goes is probably the same thing, but you're probably they'll probably have them like spawn behind them anyways, even if nobody's even near the enemy's perimeter flag. So I don't know. I don't even know if it's possible in this game to like pretty much dominate one side of the map. 
but unless you have a party or a clan, you can't really do that because everybody, no matter what game type you're in, they all just like to kill, which, you know, it's cool if you get all these kill streaks, great, but I like to win the game, you know, so that's half the time that's why my KD is bad, but and then games I tend to, you know, just be that KD guy where I just, you know, I just play for kills. And sometimes I still win, sometimes I don't, you know, whatever. But if you're in my game and you're not playing the objective at all, then just get the fuck out. I don't want you, you know, because you're just hurting the team more than anything. I think one of the biggest reasons why I've been doing so good is because I changed my gameplay from playing so aggressive to playing a little bit more conservative. Which is why we're up so far in this, at halftime, 94-67. Only 16-7, it's not too good, not too great, but it's better than bad, you know. It's not like this 58-4, and four, but, you know, it's, it's likable. <laughs> And I think I call my care package right here. Yes, I do. And what I get is, I guess, like the uh, the map specific. Yeah, Walker tanks. Those things can be so overpowered. It's ridiculous. Like anywhere on the map, you'll they'll just destroy you with a missile. It's it's really beneficial for you, obviously, but. Then I get a random headshot with a missile. That was that was definitely random. I'll tell you that. <laughs> but whatever, it works. I've gotten so used to these exos. I don't even know if I could play classic anymore. Which, that brings me to uh, another point where, you know, there's always been these, there's been this, like, rumor, or, uh, however you want to put it, about Modern Warfare 4 coming out, you know, or being made for next year, or whenever that comes out, as far as, like, that's the next Call of Duty, and I just wonder if they're gonna, you know, keep this EXO stuff going, or if it's gonna, you know, go back to the, uh, the original way it was. Which after this game, you know, that could be like a, another change of pace, but then again, they have classic in this one, so, you know, it goes both ways, so I don't know. Also, since it has been full of EXOs, would, would people go back, or do they like the new change? Because at the beginning of this game, everybody was complaining about how how much this game has been changed and how bad it is or how they don't like the exos. And then they get used to it, and then it's like, oh wow, this is actually pretty good because you can you can evade a lot of things and get away from just about anything. Like it saved my life so many times in this game. Although when I start shooting somebody, and then they exo, whether it be straight up in the air, to the side, you know, wherever, and it, it, then I get frustrated because, ah, oh, it, it, it can be very frustrating sometimes. See, like that. Like, I would have killed them in class, but anyway. I need to get some meat. Starting. So I've started this new spring training deal because I start football up in April. So I need to lose a few pounds. So if you have any tips on, I know this has nothing to do with Call of Duty or gaming. I guess it could. But if you know any tips on dieting or ways to 
lose weight and have, you know, don't be a smart ass. Like, hey, get off your ass and go exercise, because obviously. But, you know. I thought that was great. Like, right when I called this recon drone, like, somebody punched me in the back. But, yeah, back to the topic. Where, you know, if you know anything about dieting, if you know anything about, you know, weekly meals or suggestions on type of like a type of diet like a green diet or veg diet or whatever or vitamin water and celery only for the rest of my life you know that kind of thing you know just if you have any tips or suggestions you know I'd love I'd love to hear them like, comment below you know inbox me hit me up on Twitter because I'm definitely not a dietitian and you know I need to lose about I'd like to lose about 20 pounds Maybe like 10 pounds of pure fat, whatever. But here we go, this game's about to end. We are destroying him right now. 193 to 130. I did alright, you know, not the not the best, but I should have killed that guy right there. Ugh! I like I almost do 180s to kill people. And then it's like an adrenaline rush. But yeah, there we go. Game ends. 199, 133. We win. That's a big V for y'all. But and this is my boy Chad. If you guys ever want to add him, Judge McGruff 12. Send him a message. Freak him out. 29 and 19. You know, not the greatest. Seven captures, three defenses. But I thought, you know, this could be another tie over for the next one when I do amazing. All right. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Nivius out.